team at the London Eye Hospital pride themselves on being global leaders and pioneers of the latest ophthalmic technologies. The hospital's founder and chief medical director, Bobby Qureshi, has formed an innovative new company, which, by working with leading scientists from around the world, has developed a new surgical treatment to restore sight to those with dry age-related macular degeneration. Affecting at least half a million people in the UK alone, dry AMD is the leading cause of blindness in those aged over 55. London Eye Hospital Pharma's new medical device, called IOL AMD, is made up of two injectable intraocular lenses, creating a mini telescope effect that gently magnifies light entering the eye and diverts it to a healthier part of the retina. We've improved the uh, optical quality, so the patients may be capable of better vision than any other telescopic lens. We've reduced the size of the implants by using new innovative uh, materials, so it, the implants will go through a, a tiny keyhole type of incision, not requiring any sutures. So the risk these days from such a procedure is no more than a normal cataract operation and a routine lens implant. The sutureless operation takes just two to three minutes longer than a cataract procedure, with one lens injected into the capsular bag and one injected into the sulcus. It's revolutionary in its precision, says the Spanish optical physicist who created the advanced optics of the IOL AMD lenses. What we did is a design that no matter if there is some differences in the positioning of the lenses in the surgery, we still get a reasonable uh, optical quality and a reasonable vision. Thanks to IOL AMD, doctors can now offer an advanced micro-incision surgical solution to their dry AMD patients. Depending on their visual potential, patients could be able to drive, see faces and read once again, greatly improving their quality of life.